Hello everyone, VTZ32 here, today with another review for you. Today we're looking at the Leverett 1876 decks from internationalmagic.com. Let's check them out. Alright, so this is the Leverett or Leveret decks from International Magic, which is their first decks. It says Leverett 1876 on the front. Very kind of old school vintage type uh, design. It says high quality playing cards. On one side it says Leverett playing cards. The other side, same thing. Nothing on top. And the bottom, it says designed by Will Houston, International Magic, put inside by expert playing cards. And in the back, beautiful classic looking design. Reminds you a little bit of like the Prime Poker decks as well. Beautiful design, I like that. No seal, and nothing going on with the flaps either, just the color. Then we get to the cards. The Jokers, very interesting. Bunnies with a star in the corner. Kind of reminds me a little bit of, what is it, the Aladdins? They have like bunnies on them. Uh, the back design, very nice with bunnies and foilids. Beautiful, you can totally see this in green as well. Very nice pack design. I really like that. And then the Ace of Spades, Leverett, 1876. Big, nice, simple pip. Everything else is standard. Number cards, the court cards as well. The Expert Point Card Company standard court cards. Vintage style. Vintage like uh, Russell Morgan style, I believe it is. Let's show you those quickly. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Apologize about the lighting. The sun is like coming and going <laughs> it's a very very thin stock very thin crust stock i've never seen this before from extra point guards handles very nicely and then we'll get the other one it's exactly the same except in blue Gorgeous back designs. I really like that. As soon as I saw these, I'm like, I have to have these. <laughs> uh, oh. I saw it initially through somebody adding them on to Portfolio 52. So it's good to be on Portfolio 52 and checking out, you know, decks that are added because you find beautiful gems like this that I probably would not have found out about otherwise. Very nice soft stuff, by the way. I would recommend checking them out if you like them. They're beautiful cards. I like them very much. Nice thin borders as well. Can't say enough, you know, bad about them. Or any or good about them, I should say. I can't say anything bad about them. Can't say enough good about them. Uh, I will post a link in the description to International Magic website. I think it's internationalmagic.com. I could be wrong. Seems like the red one handles a bit better than the blue one for some reason, at least in my case. <laughs> um, but they're very beautiful. I like them. Worth checking out, I think. Great classic looking decks for all your magic effects and cardistry and playing cards, playing poker. And uh, that is that. I haven't, like I was saying, um, haven't seen these on too many websites that I can recall aside from the, the website that produced it, International Magic. So the link will be in the description. I think it's worth checking it out. And that is that. Like I said, solid 10 out of 10 for me. I would give it more if I could, <laughs> like 11 out of 10. And that is that. Comment, rate, subscribe, let me know what you think. We'll see you next time for more. Thanks for watching.